Hey, what's up guys? Steven here from the Collectible Reviews channel. Hope everyone is doing well. Today we're going to be taking a look at Night King on the Iron Throne Funko Pop from the Game of Thrones series. Now let's roll to the 360. Night King is one of the- Hey, what are you doing here, Mr. Batman? That's not yours to stand on. Go fight some crimes or something. Sorry about that. Here we go. As I was saying, uh, the Night King here is one of the most iconic characters in the Game of Thrones series. Here he is, sitting on the Iron Throne, looking as menacing as ever. Now, if you're thinking if he could sit up on his own without the throne, no, he cannot. He can only sit on his battle armor like this. Help, I've fallen and I can't get up. Taking a closer look here, we have the ice cold blue eyes. We have the bone thorns coming out of his head. We also have these fissure-like wrinkles, as I like to call it, on top of his head. Looking on his body, we have him wearing his chainmail with the uh, silver insignia right under his head. And uh, around the back, we have his armor flaps just magically propped up because he needs to sit on his seat. And uh, one thing I do think Funko dropped the ball on is the color of his chainmail here. Why is it this light gray color? It should be much, much, much darker. Now, if you're gonna tell me, oh, it's because they've been walking in the snow for so long and it's covered in snow. Does this look like it's covered in snow to you? No, it does not. Now let's take a look at the Iron Throne. The Iron Throne was forged under the order of Aegon Targaryen. Uh, supposedly, it was made of a thousand swords melted under the breath of Aegon's biggest dragon, Balerion the Black Dread, and it was forged into the shape of this throne. Um, as you can see, the details on this throne is pretty good. You can see a lot of swords uh, still intact with, through their original form on the seat. But does this remind you of feathers of a peacock or a turkey please comment below but uh anyways looking at the back the back's detail is not as good as the front but you know what it's better than i expected so overall i'm gonna give this night king pop here a collectible review score of seven out of ten uh, I deducted a point from the price tag of $30, which is a little bit too much for me for what it offers. And I deducted a point out of the color on the battle armor of this pop. I think Funko really dropped the ball on the color here. And lastly, I deducted a point for the peacock feathers. Sorry guys, it's just something that really bothers me. Once I see it, I can't not unsee it. All right, that's it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed the content, please like and subscribe. Tell us what you think of the pop in the comments below, and we'll see you on the next one.